All right, so I'm out in the garden today. I had to lock them out of the garden because don't you know a minute ago Sadie ran through my tomatoes? I don't know what they're doing. Anyway, I want to show you what Bob's been doing to this rose arbor. So we did this arbor with a cattle panel. We cut it in half so it's not as... And then we, um, and then we arbored it. This is a rose bush that we got on clearance at Lowe's like two years ago. And it's a amazing. Look at all the roses on that. It is amazing. I gotta figure out how to train it to do something. Anyway, um, so Bob decided that he wanted to take and run it, this rose, this climbing rose down the fence line. So he got another cattle panel and cut it in half and put some studs, struts, I don't know what you want to call them, put some wood things. I'll show you on the other side. He screwed them to the fence and then uh, zip tied them to the cattle panel. And then we're taking this rose bush, the climbing one, and training it to go down. And so it, it's gone pretty far right here, but he wants to train it so it goes all the way down and then just covers that whole thing. When looking at that rose bush, how beautiful that is. If I could like, right now it's hiding the garbage cans, which works. But then if this one goes all the way across, which is already at the top. So you can see the, so we're gonna take the cattle panel all the way across here and then it'll fill in and then it'll be like a privacy panel from the and it'll look absolutely beautiful. Look, it's already flowering all over the top there. And that one is stunning. So we bought it on clearance at Lowe's. I think we probably paid seven, five, five dollars, seven dollars for it. I'm not sure, but it's amazing. It's beautiful. So yeah, that's what we got going on on the outside of our garden. Just wanted to show you that, how beautiful that's gonna look. So if you like this short little video, just uh, stay tuned, uh, subscribe to us. We post at least once a week, most I try to do twice a week, and we will keep you updated on this arbor.